Hey folks, this is Eric Stewart with Code Green Community, and I have been working part-time at the West Pasco Habitat for Humanities Kinship Urban Farm. Over the past few months, we've been having some water problems. Our fields have been, been flooding as thousands and thousands of gallons of water have been pouring into our farm from asphalt uh, concrete. So over the past few months, I've been building a swale system and a pond, that a retention pond that's going to start storing thousands of gallons of fresh water to be used in our garden space. So I have some time-lapse photos and a little tour of the garden during a rainstorm that I'm going to be showing you in a few minutes. In the next few months, in 2015, on February uh, 21st and 22nd, we were going to be hosting a permaculture design course where we're going to be going on how, learning how to design your own edible landscape. How you can design using swales and retention ponds to store and catch water. And we have an unlimited abundance of water here in Florida. Over 55 inches of rainfall every single year. And if we can create retention ponds and swales, we can actually store 10,000, 20,000 gallons and use it for our, for our irrigation and also for raising tilapia and freshwater fish. We can integrate aquaponics and use abundance of material in our landscapes to produce a lot of food. Well, check out this upcoming tour and thank you very much. So as you can see, all this metal roof collects rainwater and it drains into this river. that flows into the garden and some of it comes into this walkway where there's a swale. The swale goes into this retention pond <laughs> Looks like we uh, have some problems with our pond here, so we'll have to fix that today. The water goes down this swale. And then into this little overflow and into the big pond. Which surprisingly we have not filled up today I was expecting it to fill it looks like we uh, filled it to the middle pond but the outer pond we still have some area and eventually what we're going to do is put some dirt in here and plant some water loving plants some taro and water chestnut and edible plants and this is our water swale system here at the Kinship Urban Farm. Thank you. If you would like to learn more about permaculture design, I'm hosting a permaculture design course at a local farm that I've been managing over the past year called Kinship Urban Farm. You can click the link below to learn more about our upcoming permaculture design course. Check out our website at codegreencommunity.com. Subscribe to our YouTube channel, like our Facebook, help with a donation on PayPal, or support my work on Patreon. Thank you very much, and enjoy our future YouTubes.